FB Tweet Pinterest email send text message print Black China testified for the third day in a row in the ongoing trial between her and the Kardashian-Jenner family. During her appearance in Los Angeles Superior Court on Thursday, China, born Angela White, offered new details about an alleged kill fee she accepted after her e-reality show, Rob and China, was cancelled. While being questioned by Kardashian-Jenner attorney Michael Rhodes, China was asked about a talent agreement she signed and the kill fee she received. The lawyer also inquired about an extension of her e-contract through August 2017, which allowed the network to decide if they wanted to renew her and Rob Kardashian's show. According to Rhodes, China, 33, was paid a $100,000 kill fee for the show and an additional $370,000 to appear on Keeping Up With The Kardashians. Though China admitted to accepting the $100,000, she said she thought the money was for filming, not because Rob and China was cancelled. Why would I sign a kill fee for my number one show? She asked, before claiming her attorney left her out of contract negotiations and that the show was still filming. China's legal battle with the Kardashian-Jenner family began in 2017. After her on-off relationship with Rob, 35, ended, China claimed the Kardashians were responsible for influencing the cancellation of her Keeping Up With Kardashians spin-off. The parents of five-year-old daughter Dream starred in the series for one season. At the time, a spokesperson for the network told Variety that Rob and China had not been in production for several months and the series is not currently on the e-schedule. Earlier in the week, Rhodes argued in court that China wanted the Kardashian name and would say or do anything to be part of this family. Rhodes also claimed Rob and China got into a major fight on the day the second season of Rob and China was announced, more than five years ago. Rhodes alleged that Kris Jenner's boyfriend, Corey Gamble, had to break up a screaming and yelling argument between the two by physically getting between them at Kylie Jenner's house. Related Video Additionally. Rhodes claimed that Rob and China was never picked up for a second season because the relationship between the pair was off the rails. This relationship was fraught with problems and the network was very worried, Rhodes said, adding that the Kardashian family was also concerned. They were acting against their own financial interest to protect someone they loved. Rhodes maintained that Rob and China was cancelled by E! because the couple called off their engagement and split for good in February 2017. However, China's lawyer, Lin Chani, continued to counter that Chris and her daughters set out to have Rob and China cancelled even though Rob wanted it to keep going. Despite Rob's wishes, Chani claimed the Kardashian Jenners moved ahead to get the show off fee which Keeping Up With The Kardashians also aired on. Because of the show's cancellation, Chani argued that China lost out on the potential to earn millions of dollars from related appearances and social media posts, 